We're going to conclude this program with one of my famous magic tricks, and we will use, what is your name down here? Beth. Beth. Beth, come on up. Come on. Let's give Beth a big applause over here. Yeah. Beth, right over here. Beth, we, send this way. We are going to do something very, very special, okay? We are going to make a bunny appear out of a hat. Right. Have you ever seen that done before? No. We're going to show you today. It's actually very old. Not many people do it these days because we don't wear top hats anymore. You see any bunnies inside there? No. No. Watch this. Open it up. Hold it like this. Here's what happens. You turn and face the hat. You raise your hands up like this. Wiggle your fingers like this. Move them back and forth like, like this. The magic words are bunny, bunny, bunny. But you have to say it loud enough so the folks in the cheap seats back there can hear it, okay? Ready? A bunny will then appear in the hat. You reach inside, pick it out. You give her a wonderful applause. Are you ready? ready. Get your applause machines ready. Go. Bunny, 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 loud. Bunny, bunny, bunny. That's it. Reach inside. Give her a big applause. Give her a big applause. Rick, did, did, did you forget to put the bunny in the hat? I thought you put the bunny in the hat. Oh, it was your turn. Got an idea. <laughs> Let's do something better than a bunny. What could be better than a bunny? A balloon. A balloon. <laughs> it's true, it's true. Watch this. I can make anything out of a balloon. Does it look like a bunny yet? No. It will watch. A bunny! Look! Look! It even has an ear! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Don't bunnies have two ears? Yeah. You want to see two ears? Yeah. Cross your eyes. One, two, one, two. No, wait! Now, wh what about the cute little fuzzy tail? You want to see the tail? Tickle, tickle, tickle! Oh, that's just so it's fun. not the same. You can't even pet it. Sure you can pet it. Watch this. <laughs> Isn't that fun? No. It's funny. Look, I will prove that this is better than any real bunny. Watch. Hold, hold that for a second. Um, I got an idea. You see, I um, brought a little cage to put my little bunny in so everybody could pet him after the show. We're going to meet you guys out in the back and you can pet a little, a little bunny. But since I don't have one, um, we're going to put this in there and I'll show you why it's better. You see, when you, when you do this, in there like, like that, you can look at it all day and you don't have to feed it. But wait, better. You, you, don't, you don't get to see that cute little bunny nose. Better than that. You'll never be asked to clean the cage again. That's better, isn't it? But look how sad she is. She wanted to see a live bunny. Let me see how sad she looks. <laughs> uh, upside down frown. Okay. One more time. Try this way. Turn this way. Now let me hold these for you. Put your hands up like this. Now all by yourself, you're going to do this. You're going to go one, Two, three, like that, all by yourself. Just not like a magician. Are you ready? Okay. Go. One, One two, three, like that. <gasps> oh, look what you did! Oh. <laughs> Let's give her a wonderful applause. That's a wonderful job. <laughs> Want to give him a hug? Yeah. Okay. Come here, come here, come here, come here. We have. Look at that. And then look at the camera way up there and say, I did it! I did it! Yes, you did! <laughs> Thank you very much! Oh, <laughs> and a big applause for our helper right over here. She goes back to her seat. Thank you very much! <laughs> That's it for us. My name is Rick. And I'm Kara. Good night! Good night! <laughs> Rick and Kara Ewing, aren't they terrific? <laughs>